TFNN. Headline News Update. Morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of, well, looks like a pretty sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and currently have all the U.S. indices that we track trading to the downside. You've got the Dow up 422 points. That's 1.5%. The S&P 1 and 7 tenths are 65 points. NASDAQ 100, 262, 2 and a quarter, 2 and 3 tenths for the Russell. That's 41 points, 55 for the semis, 1.5% for the trannies out there. You've got gold trading off 14 bucks at 17.16. Silver's down 82 cents at 2027. Lights recruit is up a buck 58, and natural gas up three ticks after forming a buy the D point pattern yet. Yesterday, 30 treasures off two points and four ticks. She's trading at 126.18. Let's go take a look at that nine panel market update chart. We begin in the upper left hand corner. You've got the ES mini. What did it do? Ran right into resistance yesterday. Why did price stop where it did? Because that's where the sellers are at. 3806, 3807 is really the top of that profile. Uh, the high from yesterday was uh, 3808.75. So price right now just consolidating with inside the daily profile. Perfect example of how you and I take advantage of these profiles. They tell us where the buyers and the sellers reside. Now, you've got the spot volatility still well above its 50-day exponential moving average. The 50 days at 26.67. This market will not be in any kind of bull, true bull mode unless that spot volatility gets below the 50-day. 26.67 is the print. If we take a look at the NQ. Uh, still just consolidating with inside its daily profile. Not really much to add there. U.S. dollar index uh, is traded down towards the support area of the bottom of its daily profile. That's 109.64. And it was dealing with the top of its weekly profile at 110.48. Now, trading into resistance. That's the top of the profile. So 111.91. So you want to watch that area out there. If we take a look at gold, gold is uh, closed above the top of its daily profile. That's a beautiful thing. The top of that profile is 1695.70, but it is pulling back. We'll go explore gold during the Trader's Ed show. Silver now is confirming or appears to be confirming a sell the D point pattern. So you've got a bearish reversal candle as of 11.02 in the morning, or 11.02, yeah, I don't know what we'll have at day's end, but if it is a bearish reversal candle, we're expecting silver to pull back. Lightsweet Crude is trading right now above the top of its daily profile, 86.68, that suggests a run as long as it can hold this, 86.68 to 90.65. That is the top of the weekly profile. As I mentioned, natural gas did complete a buy the D point pattern yesterday, trading with inside its daily profile right now, but I believe it's struggling to overcome its oscillator and change line. We'll take a look at that during the break as well. But folks, if you're off to start your Wednesday, please have a wonderful one. Thanks so much for joining us, and we'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care now.